The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen-only mode. Good morning, and thank you for attending our webinar this morning. Uh, this is Jim Guinan. I'm an annuity sales director here with Insurance Agency Marketing. And today, um, we will be joined by Brett Walderbach of North America, and he's, he will be talking with you momentarily about one of North American's uh, top-selling annuity products called the VersaChoice 10. So I will be, um, as I say, turning the presentation over to him in a, in a few minutes and uh, do want to remind you that our webinar today is recorded. So if for some reason you have to leave early or um, just aren't able to continue with the whole program or would like to hear it again, we do record our webinars and uh, make it available for you uh, not too long um, afterwards. So uh, we do, again, thank you for your time this morning. We appreciate that. And uh, if there's any questions that you have um, for Brett or myself, you can type those questions in and we'll be glad to answer those at the end of the presentation. Um, also, of course, you can uh, reach out to me uh, at any point today or as the week continues if there's questions that you think of about North American, about their products, or in particular on the VersaChoice 10. So uh, with that, I want to just uh, tell you a little bit about what's going on here at Insurance Agency Marketing, and then we'll get to uh, the, the uh, product part and the sales part of the presentation here. So I want to talk to you about our business builders here at Insurance Agency Marketing. And of those, uh, the Referred Producer Program is an ongoing program we've offered for a number of years. As you can see, this is a way for you to refer other qualified producers to us here and uh, meanwhile uh, get paid to do so. So when you refer a producer, we'll pay you $50 for when they contract and then an ongoing in essence, an ongoing override, and that's unlimited. So you're not limited to one referral per year. Um, you can you could refer a number of producers to us. So that's our way, of course, of saying thank you for putting us in touch with qualified producers. Our marketing reimbursement program um, is continuing to go forward, and how that operates basically is for the premium that you write index premium for single premium life for example we put in essence uh, dollars away for your for future expenses and it's not a uh, program that has to be use it or lose it at the end of the year for example so it's an ongoing if you have a seminar program or a lead uh, quarterly lead drop that you want to take advantage of and you have those expenses, you just submit those into our accounting department for marketing reimbursement. So you build up several thousand dollars, we, we will pay you 50 cents on the dollar for um, your business expenses. So our way of saying thank you again for ongoing business, and you can build that account up as much as you'd like, and you have an expense, submit the receipts and we'll reimburse you 50% of that cost. Uh, the other way that we help you with your business and give you a jump start when you first start writing with us here at Insurance Agency Marketing is the new producer bonus. And um, we do have three different threshold levels that you can attain in your first six months of writing business with us. And so as you reach these thresholds at the end of that term, these are the type of things that you can look to be reimbursed for or compensated for um, with the business that you're submitting us to, to us here. So again, our thanks to you for um, placing business with us in your first 180 days. And um, again, I think a very, very generous uh, new producer bonus. Um, I, have, I have shopped this program to other IMOs and I have not found many, if any, that offer a new producer bonus and marketing reimbursement to their producers. Uh, 
Okay, let's move on, talk a little bit about our support here. Again, that's what really any IMO's job is to do, is to help you in your, in your practice to, in essence, step back, serve as your back office to free up your time to, to sell. So um, using a number of uh, people here, uh, I should say not using, but utilizing the, the, the sort resources that we offer to you, um, we do have the paperless contracting that saves a lot of time. The uh, life and annuity quotes we do um, we do as marketers as well as we have uh, coordinators that can help you with your annuity quotes. The life department also supports you in that way, and it does. We do talk about our website a little bit here in a moment, but our website has some great resources to help you. Uh, a resources library, a quote engine for term and UL quotes. You have our rate book for annuities available to you. So there's a lot of support that we provide to you around the clock. Um, but our job and the job of our case managers is to help you get the business in, have it uh, reviewed, and then for us to follow up on those cases as much as we can uh, to make sure that they get issued and that you get paid properly. Our creative department has been uh, very active lately. I think uh, an area that we're told is of great demand is helping build or improve websites for producers. So if, you've, um, if you have an interest in talking more about how to improve your presence, uh, social media, or a website, if you have a website, you'd like to have it updated or have us uh, review some ways to make that connect with your brand, let us know. Uh, email newsletters are also something that uh, we see a lot of demand for. So again, uh, Andrew and the creative department are um, able and willing to talk with you, give you some ideas about things you can do to uh, brand yourself better, to maybe uh, you utilize these areas for prospecting and um, improve your business brand. Okay, and I mentioned our website. If you've not been to our website, uh, that's, a, I think, a valuable tool that you should take advantage of. It's www.iamsinc.com. That's I-A-M-S-I-N-C.com. And I mentioned a number of things here. Our webinar schedule is out there. Um, so if you're looking forward to future webinars and want to know what's, a, what's coming up, both life and annuity. Our annuity grid is available in there. It's about 42 pages of information on our uh, more popular, more competitive products. Certainly not everything is on that rate book. We have 35 companies. It's pretty hard to have all of it there, but we do have the better uh, selling products from each of our top carriers, multi-year rate fixed, income rider grid that gives you a comparison of what the carriers offer, uh, from some of our better uh, competitive products. Again, not all of them there. Um, we also do have forms available, our term code engine, and the resource library. So again, if you've not been to our website, and, not, and if it's been a while, you may want to check it out. Uh, I use it pretty much daily uh, to help producers like yourself with income rider comparisons. Um, it also has a search tool if, let's say, that you're looking uh, for an 85, uh, you know, you have a prospect that's 85 years old, you want to know what index products are available, is there a bonus available in your state, and uh, there's just no way for us to internally keep track of all of that, so we rely on this too. Okay, IMS Wealth Management um, is a division of insurance agency marketing. Uh, they've been in existence for a little over two years now. And um, if you have some interest in uh, looking more into becoming part of a registered investment advisor, uh, would like to expand your business in a new way, um, we can certainly get you some information about the IMS Wealth Management Program, um, you know, what it costs to get licensed, what are some ongoing um, costs that, it, that are involved, because there are your securities licensed, but also what, uh, what the potential is for you as a, an advisor. 
um, in revenue and client retention. So if you'd like to know more about how, you know, how to go about this and get some information, um, I'd like to uh, go ahead and just uh, I'll put out there the poll question. If you'd like to get a little bit more information, um, we could have Charles and his team reach out to you and give you some ideas about what are the expectations as an investment advisor rep under RIA um, and what it can mean for you. So, um, again, if you have interest in that, let us know. Um, after the webinar, you'll be contacted, and if you'd like to get something on an email or just have a discussion with Charles or Mike or Joan, they'd be glad to talk to you more about IMS Wealth Management. So I do appreciate your response to that. Moving on, uh, I want to talk to you about our academy. And uh, we did just complete a, a two-day academy here at our Omaha brokerage office about uh, two weeks ago. And we had about 35 producers in. Uh, Brett was actually here. So, uh, you know, we had, we had some home office individuals, which is great because you have the ability to, to reach out and visit with uh, carriers that you can place business through. And so this is a Life and Annuity Academy. It's an all-expense paid program. It's two days of training. Um, there's a lot compressed into that two days. And uh, we do have plans for another um, session of this training this summer. Uh, I don't have exact dates, but we're looking at probably early August. So if you have interest in getting more information, or a uh, or would like to fill out a registration we'd be glad to do so after the webinar is over if you answer yes to the question we will send you a registration link and more information including a sample agenda as you can see on the screen some of the topics that we go through the the program is updated every time uh, we do offer uh, you the ability to talk to and hear from individuals that our seminar selling um, that's not something you have to do, but we do make that available for you to hear from a couple of our top producers and how they work in the seminar program. We also have uh, information on our IMS Wealth Management uh, also has an opportunity to talk to you. But most importantly, we're looking for individuals that are writing fixed annuity and life business and would like to grow that business. So if you're new, in this business, this industry, you've not really worked with life or annuities. You're just kind of getting a start. This is not an academy for you, all right? Um, but if you do have interest in that, please let us know. Like I said, you'll get an email after the webinar is over with some more information. And certainly you can always ask me or any of the other marketers, maybe some that you already work with or talk to, and um, find out more about it. So we do appreciate your response to that question and uh, we do look forward to uh, our future academies attending we do uh, like I say about 35 producers per Academy is what we limit that to okay and lastly I want to talk about our um, marketing summit that is scheduled for uh, August of next year and again this is an invitational it's an educational and social uh, event. The period of time that we look at for this uh, would be through June of 2019. Again, you can see uh, sort of what we're looking for as far as production in order to be invited for this. Uh, again, we just completed one earlier this year at Boulder's Resort in uh, Arizona, our most well-attended marketing summit program to date. So we do look forward to helping you with that. If you've written business with us, by the way, you probably are getting, are getting reports from us on where you stand with that. But again, it is an invite only. If you have any further questions about that, again, let me know. Let our, our marketing staff know. We'll be glad to visit with you about where you're currently at in, the, in this program. Okay, so with that, I want to... Uh, Move the presentation over to Brett, and he will talk to you more about uh, what's happening at North American. Brett?
All right. Thank you so much, Jim. Appreciate that. And, uh, you know, good morning, everybody. Appreciate you know, the time that you've taken to attend this webinar. And I want to open uh, the webinar with a bit of a rhetorical question since we are all uh, on a listen only line besides Jim and myself. But who here has had uh, a client or even a, a family member uh, have to be concerned about going back to work in, in retirement? So, and that, that is an issue that I had a family member deal with, and it was my grandfather specifically, uh, who worked for 35 years at Collins Rockwell in, in Cedar Rapids, Iowa, here in the central part of the state. And, you know, during retirement, got a chance to do a, a lot of things, moved to a nice warm climate area uh, for a while, and eventually uh, had to move uh, back to the Midwest, uh, couldn't uh, live in that warm climate for the, through retirement, because uh, just didn't have the nest egg really built for that. And it wasn't um, you know, recession proof, didn't have safety mechanisms uh, built right inside there. Uh, and with the tech bubble bursting in 2000, and then, you know, with the nail in the coffin uh, was 2008, he eventually had to go back to work uh, and go back to work at a Walmart. Uh, as start off, like probably, you know, most people uh, in retirement going back to work, greeted for a while, uh, end up going and working in the meat department. Uh, and you might be asking, you know, why am I bringing this story up? And, and I want to bring this story up because, you know, no agent or advisor wants to sit down and have those conversations with their clients uh, because they weren't prepared. They didn't have the safety mechanisms uh, to help them through retirement, not just to retirement, but through, and especially a long retirement that could be lasting, you know, 30 years plus. So, and today I want to talk to you about a solution uh, that can help with that. And I don't want to product dump. I want to provide some value with some some concepts that you can take right to your client meetings. So with that, I'm going to talk to you about uh, one of our newest solutions, uh, one of the kind of the, the top products uh, in our portfolio that's getting a lot of attention is the Versa Choice. So the Versa Choice is a modified single premium. Let's get my screen to pick up here, my fancy graphics. So it is a modified single premium product uh, from a spec standpoint. Uh, but this product is, is really built to do a lot of things. So we like to call it the Ali product uh, in our platform, uh, which Muhammad Ali might have been the greatest boxer of all time in some opinions. Uh, and this could be one of the greatest design products of all times uh, because you can use it for accumulation. You can use it for liquidity or enhanced liquidity. Uh, and you can also use it for income. So first of all, I wanna to talk to you about the Versa Choice for accumulation. So, and what type of prospects would you be working with that could be a good candidate for accumulation. Those are those clients that are looking for that true safe money alternative. So they want nothing more but to grow. They have no interest in putting money in the CD. They don't want to participate in money markets because they have no interest on the money really earning nothing for them. So they really want that safety and accumulation. So when you think about an annuity product, then you have to get to the really the core there, the nuts and bolts. So how does this product accumulate to maximize that? It does feature some of the industry's top crediting uh, rates and strategies. So you can see here, it's very simple in design. You have a fixed account. So that is a one year declared rate. So you have a monthly cap. So you have an annual point to point cap. So we have our S&P 500 low volatility daily risk controls, which is a stock picking uh, methodology. So with the 100 least volatile stocks, then we have the S&P Mark V access return index. So and I want to point out to one what that is. It is as an asset allocation indice uh, using equities, commodities, and interest rate futures, but it also features 100% participation with a zero margin. So whatever this returns with our high band rating at 75,000 above, the client gets everything. So last year was up over 10% with no margin that we're offering, so the client would get the entire returns of that indice. So, and then we have a very popular point-to-point -point participation rate. We declare rate, 40 or 45% is in here. Track the S&P annually, you get 40 or 45% of the returns of the S&P 500. That's also a very simple story. So that was accumulation. Again, clients looking for safe money solution. So we're, they just wanna see that grow with some of the competitive rates in the industry. And that's what Verse Choice can do for you for just the raw product. Again, it's a 10 year solution, modified single premium. Again, what that means for your clients is they can add premiums in that first year. So now let's talk about the Versa Choice for liquidity. And liquidity can mean a lot of things to a lot of different people. But if you think about the prospects that you have for liquidity, are they concerned about future health cost needs? Are they looking for something that has 
peace of mind for the unexpected and have the ability to get some money out of there when those things happen. If you have clients like this, Versa Choice could be the right fit for you. Because what Versa Choice has is the enhanced liquidity benefit, right? Or that is optional to this product for 50 basis points. So this is one of my favorite slides because it's very simple. So we like to use you know, the, the KISS method or the keeping it simple method here. And if you look at this, so there are quadrants on the left-hand side, the quadrants on the right-hand side. Right now I wanna focus on the left-hand side quadrants because these two features are available for anyone right after issue. So that is an enhanced penalty-free withdrawal and also return of premium. So let's talk in detail about the enhanced penalty-free withdrawal. So this product will give them just stock 10% out every year, including the first year. If they don't use that, that 10% carries into the next year. So you'd have 20%, and that would be the max withdrawal rate that a client could take out at any time. So if you think about it, every other year, you could be taking 20% out of here at a time. So again, if you think about those clients for you know, accumulation, but they're also worried about you know, going into annuity with markets at all-time highs, you could slowly, every two years, pull 20% out to buy back into an equity position if you wanted to, where markets are not at high, especially if we come off a significant re uh, recession or a, a correction. But what about return of premium? I'm sure everyone's had clients that have gotten cold feet around the re renewal time. Maybe the strategy didn't perform the way they hoped it would the first year. Uh, you know, you know, maybe there was just very little growth and there was, you know, they just you know, wanted some more upside even though they had the protection with not much growth. They just weren't happy with it. You have the ability to leverage that return of premium. And you can leverage that return of premium after they've completed two full years. And you might be thinking to yourself, well, return of premium sounds great for my client, but how does that impact me? Because usually with a surrender of a contract, even with return of premium, there are surrender charges or commission chargebacks uh, that are gonna impact you, the agent. I'm happy to let you know that we have thought of that as well. Not only are we helping you protect your client, we're helping protect you and we're helping protect our partners at insurance agency marketing. So because the chargeback period is only through the first year. So they get in that second year, they can take 20% out. Maybe you have that you know, end of year review and then say, you know, I think it's best if we pull the rest of this and reposition it. They can grab that remaining 80% to make them true. We'll also refund back the two year of fees that they paid on that. So it is a true return of premium. And no one is the wiser from a chargeback. You can help them reposition uh, those assets again uh, and, and line up with their goals. So those are available for everybody, regardless of the issue of the policy and what your health is. The other two benefits on the right side are the first to market ADL based. So activities of daily living based benefits. So, and all of this is available for 50 basis points. So if you have clients that are in good health, but maybe they can't qualify for a long-term care uh, type policy because from a medical underwriting standpoint, they're uninsurable, but they're in pretty good health. They just, you know, um, you know, not in great health or, or those are in, you know, affordable or they like the idea of insurance, but they don't want to pay the ongoing premiums. This could be a nice alternative way to supplement that because there is no underwriting. It's suitability. So they will attest that they can provide all six activities of daily living. And then after the issues, after 90 days of not being able to perform but two of six activities of daily living, they unlock these two benefits, the ADL-based surrender charge waiver and the ADL-based benefit payout. So really what that is in a brief summary is we'll waive the surrender charges right away, even if it's within the, say, the first six months of the policy that happened. So you'll have a waiver of surrender charges. You can take as much money out of there as you need be. And then the ADL-based enhanced payout kicks in at year three. These benefits are interchangeable. So obviously if you make the decision to do a return of premium, you, there's no coming back for that. Uh, but just because you unlock the ADL based benefits and you don't have the enhanced payout available to you, it doesn't mean you can't use the waiver of surrender charges to take as much as you need and leave the remaining in there. So here's my very busy slide that's compliance approved. That in full detail talks about the benefits or the description of every single one of these. So again, highlighting on this one, the ADL-based waiver of surrender charges for clients that are unable to complete two of six ADLs after issue, they will get 100% of their accumulation value immediately if they needed to with no surrender charges. So, and then that last quadrant, they will have the ADL-based enhanced payout, again, for not being able to perform two out of six 
activities of daily living after issue. So this one becomes available in year three, and I will lay out that schedule for you here. So how that works, day one, year three, regardless of how long you've unlocked the ADL-based benefits, you can now take advantage of 110% payout of your accumulation value over the next five years. If it's year four, it's 115%. If it's year five, it's 120%. And year six and beyond, it's 125%. And again, just because you might unlock these benefits early in the contract when it's not available, doesn't mean clients are gonna immediately pull all their money out of there because they have the waiver of surrender charges. They might need to take 20, 30%, but the remaining in there is gonna be earning interest based off the strategies they elected, and they could still enact this benefit later on down the road when they need it and when it's most beneficial to them. So one thing that I put together for you is an example illustration. So, and what I have here is a client 45 purchasing this with $100,000. So we're using our Mark 5 strategy with 100% participation and zero margin. That's got an annual effective rate of 5.8%. Uh, but now this client's gonna start unlocking ADL-based benefits. So I wanna highlight where on the illustration uh, those are shown. Over here in the far right column, you can see uh, this is the fourth quadrant, the enhanced payout, what that payout would be over five years, uh, taking those five equal payments. Also want to point out that in year six, so with the waiver of surrender charges, the client could walk away with 139.78 if they unlock that benefit. Or they could take the five pay at 34,944 and take a benefit of $174,720 taking those payments. So that's how you, you take a look at that and, and understand where those enhanced liquidity options are being shown on your illustration. You see, very powerful for accumulation with some of those returns, as well as how those benefits get enhanced for clients that can't perform these activities of daily living. So we've talked about the versa choice. I apologize here, we've got a summary slide here. Versa choice for the accumulation. Here's a summary of the enhanced liquidity benefit that's available for, for your clients. So again, two are available with regardless of your health. The other two unlock once you can't perform, but two out of six activities of daily living. So that's accumulation and liquidity. Now I wanna to talk to you about the first choice for those clients that need those things, but I also need a lifetime income stream that I can count on. So with that, the Versa choice has an additional rider that can be added at an additional cost, but you can't have both at the same time. And what are those clients that you might be prospecting look like for that Versa choice? They might have that accumulation. They might have those concerns for future costs. Most clients want everything these days and they want that lifetime income. It's hard to deliver in one product everything that they need for that, especially when Versa choice I mentioned has the first to market ADL based benefits. So we can introduce and, and add on the income pay plus benefit to the verse choice for 105 basis points. Again, I, I mentioned you can't have both writers who have to use you know, some uh, creative design and we'll show you a case study to be able to leverage both of your clients with one set of assets. So the writer is available for your clients, age 40 and above. So they at least have to have 20,000 to get into the product and have the writer for qualified and non-qualified. So it's gonna give them lifetime payout amounts so that are levelized or increasing. So we have one of the few reserve lifetime payout. So if a client has say 11,000 payable to them and they don't wanna take it all, they only wanna take what their RMD is, the remaining goes into a reserve tank that they can use for future needs. It features a nursing home doubler. So with a potential design, you could have an ADL based enhanced payout. You could also have with an income, a nursing home multiplier as well. And they can do spousal continuance. So again, here's a snapshot of what payouts would be at 50 through 80 and beyond for level or increasing. And if you note on the bottom of the screen here, it's a 50 base point reduction if they wanna have a joint covered person on there. That it does have to be spouses. And there is a minimum of a one year deferral or the age of 50 to be able to activate this. So then very similar, I do just have a, a nice raw snapshot for you of what that illustration would look like with the income pay plus rider using the same index strategy. You can see you're getting a 6% roll up for the first 10 years. So you can see your lifetime payout percentage is increasing as you are deferring that. So that'll also show you what your, what your lifetime payout would be. Whoops, my cursor disappeared, there we go. 
and then you can see your multiplier payout for the nursing home. Now in the illustration, you can say, I only wanna take maybe the RMD out of there, so to show you what the LPA reserve buildup would be that you'd have, and that can be taken out in lump sum if need be. That can also be taken out uh, time over time as well. And then here is just a nice you know, scenario that's in our brochure that talks about, again, how that LPA, lifetime payout reserve works. So again, you have a client that's got a benefit in the fifth year of $11,241. They wanna take the 5,621, the other 5,620 goes into that reserve tank. And as they continue to leverage that, uh, only taking partial withdrawals, that builds up that reserve tank that they can use to self-fund pretty much anything that they would wanna do in the future, whether that's travel, whether that's additional medical expenses, you know, whether they can use it to help grandkids with you know, college tuition payments, or uh, maybe a first time home, they have the ability to leverage it for whatever they need it would be. So let's recap again. So we talked about verse choice for accumulation, that's our A and Ali. We talked about verse choice for liquidity, our L and Ali. And we also talked about it for the income, which is the I and Ali. So again, you can see this is a great right, left, and jab and uh, uppercut punch on there. Uh, from a, a boxing reference. So now let's talk about a sales idea that can really help you kind of paint the picture how I might take this to my clients and put together a case design. So let's say we have a client, they get 200,000 and they want everything. They want the uh, accumulation, they want flexibility to access money when they need it, and they want that lifetime income. So we know this product leverage highest rates at 75,000 and above for the banding, um, and we can leverage this in two contracts. Again, I mentioned earlier, liquidity means different things to everybody. So do they mean they want $200,000 liquid? No, they don't mean 200,000. They're thinking in the realm of maybe 50 to 60,000. So how can we help them with that design? So if you leverage this with two contracts for the same client, so you could do the first 75 to leverage high band pricing for that uh, accumulation and liquidity or flexibility. Uh, you can use the enhanced liquidity benefit writer on that contract to give them that. And then you could use the other contract with the income pay plus writer with the remaining 125,000 to generate that guaranteed lifetime income. Now on both of those, they got 10% each year out. With the 75,000, they can take an additional 20%. That's really 30% or really 40% that you could take out by year four or year two, I should say, I apologize, from both those contracts. You got lifetime payout, you got the LPA reserve, so you also have ADL-based benefits on the one on the 75,000 if that were to unlock. Then you'd have a nursing home doubler on the income pay plus. Also, if they didn't do private care and they did go to a nursing facility, uh, when they're not able to perform those activities of daily living. So it's a very powerful solution that does knock out the competition. So with that, I will take any questions that we have, uh, Jim, and I wanna thank everybody for their time as I turn it back over to you. Thanks, Brad. Appreciate it. Um, I don't have any questions here. I think you must have covered everything, but I'm sure that right. we will. <laughs> I'm sure that there'll be questions that will come up um, going forward as as agents get more information, perhaps uh, product information sent to them, and uh, start looking at it as a possibility to write an annuity with. Um, so I do appreciate all your information. I do want to. Also make available for uh, the people on the webinar today that if you'd like to get uh, contracting from from us or more information on the product uh, that Brett went through, we'd be glad to get that for you. And um, do you see that poll on your screen, by the way, Brett? Uh, I don't, uh, but I do see that it says it's open in my toolbar. So let me see because this over. There you go. Okay, so there we go. Sorry about that. So if you do have uh, want to get more information on the Versa Choice 10 or uh, contracting information from North American, please respond to that poll question, and we'll be glad to get the information out for you here after the webinar is over today. So um, I do want to thank you, though, Brett. Appreciate all your input. Um, and again, if there's any questions that you out there have. In the meantime, let us know and we'll be glad to answer those and get you, again, more concrete information on the product. Um, also, it can be illustrated, correct, Brett? Absolutely, those are examples that I just updated this morning with the improved rates that started today. 
Great. Yeah. And those are good rates too. 6% annual point to point cap is very strong right now on the S and P, for example, uh, there aren't a lot of companies in that range. So, uh, but we do thank you for your time today, Brett, appreciate it. And uh, all of you have a great rest of your week and let us know what you need from North American. Have a great day. All right. Thanks, Jim. Thank you.